Also Buch, check, und ähm, Uhr, check, und äh, Blind Date, <lacht> check. <lacht> It's nice for me to play a romantic lead, you know, and not him not be a schlub or a loser. It's like Jack, Jack, yeah, Jack's emotionally complex, but he's kind of, you know, he's, he's got his own house and he wears a nice coat and is capable of going on a date with uh, someone as delightful as Nancy. So spät bin ich doch gar nicht, oder? He's a hopeless romantic. He totally believes in in the notion of romance and the possibility of meeting that one person who'll change your life. In letzter Zeit war es so, dass ich ein paar one night stands hatte, eher Zufallsbekanntschaften von der Arbeit und aus Bars oder einfach von der Straße. When you meet Jack, first of all, he's obviously a little nervous and uh, apprehensive about the blind date, but he's also quite cool and he's proactive. And during the film, you start to just see the cracks in that facade and you see that he's not quite as cool as he makes out. He's actually pretty damaged and wounded and things that he did before you realize that uh, come apparent, like, you know, taking Nancy to the bar or Jessica, as he believes she is, to the bar where him and his ex-wife used to go in the hope that maybe she might see them together kind of thing. What genau willst du denn erreichen? Ich glaube, man nennt es Abschluss. So he's really fun to play, you know, because he sort of he reveals himself in increments and to the point when eventually he is completely laid bare and you know has to do something that, that opens him up raw, you know, in order to sort of try and win the date. <laughs>